you know, we were talking about Sean Spicer, uh, but there is a, a deputy White House press secretary. Her name is Sarah Huckabee Sanders. And she talked about the firing of Comey as being, because Comey had done atrocities, right? Atrocities. Yeah. 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 Kind of so, atrocities. I, so I say, yeah. not for nothing, babe, but here's some real atrocities, like the Holocaust. Atrocity. 9-11 attacks, Rwanda genocide, Armenian genocide, Sandy Hook shooting, Darfur, those are atrocities. Mm -hmm. Overstepping your bounds, not so much. Yeah. 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 So I just want to make sure that since you're going to be the def the person who's giving us the information. Kind of communicating. Who's communicating. <laughs> Is she taking over for Spicer? I think if he's having a little breakdown and he's hiding yeah. in the bushes, yeah. yeah. It looks like she's testing I for that he's job. he's hiding from Trump. Yeah. I really do. Maybe he's really? Yeah. Maybe he's hiding from Trump. He's, he's got to go further than the bushes. Yeah. He has, that guy. The bushes won't let him in the door. Yeah. <laughs> no, he has a tough job. I mean, I, would you, I wouldn't want to get on TV every day and, and have to defend some of the and stuff that he does. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to have to do that job. Yeah. I think he has to lie because his boss is telling him what to say. Yeah. And he's lying and so he's lying. But it has sort of devolved this, this role of the press secretary. I remember when James Brady was the press secretary. Um, and, and you have Ari Fleischer, George Stephanopoulos, who was really the communications director, but also gave a lot of press conferences. <laughs> So there was just this level of confidence I think you had in your press secretary, yeah. and now he's hiding the yeah, bushes. Yeah, but you know what's interesting? If you look it's at Sean, if you look at Spicer before <laughs> this whole saga, though, he he used to sound together. I mean, I remember I remember hearing him speak and thinking, mm. this is a guy who's kind of got it together. I think yeah. this in this position, I certainly wouldn't want to be the person that has to go back and talk to Donald Trump and come out and present. He's got to be back there breaking a sweat every day. Yeah. I mean, this is this is not an easy job. About that thing you said before about the word atrocity, though. Mm -hmm. I think you're right. I think she was basically trying to say there was, you know, some justification for this firing. But it brings up the point of if you take but a what's job the, wait, like this, I'm, I'm a little confused. With Comey? what was the atrocity she was referring to? All the things well, referred to in the letter of white. In the fired. letter, does she know what an atrocity actually is? Because it's right. an extremely wicked. That's and what I'm saying. Act. That's typically one involving physical violence or injury. Right. Well, that's yeah. that's the point I'm trying okay. to make, which is that if you take Sorry, a job like you. this and you're going to be front and center mm -hmm. and your job is to is to talk to media and talk, you you need to think before. Before you speak, you need to choose your words yeah. carefully. Yeah. 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 Look yeah. up a better word. Yeah. 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 And so now, you know, that brings us to other crazy stuff. Oh, I thought I had a minute, so I'm going to keep going.